all about asking the right question. Um, it only applies serious ill health, occupational pensions only. Early retirement before age 60 is allowed for personal pensions and PRSAs. So just to summar summarize, oh, we're, we're, we're back on time. <laughs> never a bad thing, never a bad thing. Um, just to summarize, I think you guys are really the people who are best placed. Be it you're a solicitor, be you're a tax advisor, but somebody involved in the trust and estate planning. You are the people who are going to meet the people who need this advice. All I'm saying is be aware and make a call to somebody who might be able to help on this. Because you could go through it and the person could unfortunately die, the benefit is paid out, no one will be the wiser. But how much benefit could it be if somebody's in an awful situation and you can say to them, look, we might be able to get our hands on a million euro here, tax free, we set up education for your kids, we set up money because they only need it for maybe three or seven years, life is completely different. And it just means that they leave this world with a certain amount of things are sorted. And I think that's important. Um, be aware of the different pension types. That's all you have to do. You don't have to understand how it works. Just stay in your head. Yeah, there are different types. We need to know which one is and what sort of benefit is paid out. Um, and get advice where the risk is material. Now, that's where it's difficult because you might be told something you think it's not really material. The most, the ones you need to look out for, the two you look out for, define benefit schemes. Because it sounds like the benefit's really small. I'm entitled to 20 grand when I hit 65. I'm entitled to 30 grand when I hit 50 or whatever the case may be. Um, look out for defined benefits. The second one you look out of, serious ill health. Somebody who has a short life expectancy. They can do things and maneuver and move things and transfer things that will make a difference. And advice is important on that. So, that's everything from us. Uh, thanks a million, thanks a million for facilitating me so early again. Um, uh, thanks for listening. I am around for a while. We're here to around half eleven and then I'm sprinting out to Dublin Airport. Thanks a million. Derek, now that we have just a little bit of time before coffee, maybe if anyone has oh, yeah, questions, yeah. Yeah. now we might take them um, if anyone has any questions. That was really interesting. Thank you so much. I think it's great for us to even have sort of flags um, to look out for in the course of advising clients on pensions. Does anybody have any questions they'd like to ask Derek? Not too hard. <laughs> well, as we mentioned, he'll be around over coffee anyway, so please feel free to, to come up and have a chat, and maybe we might uh, break for coffee now, and I'd love to come back within sort of half an hour, 40 minutes. If that's okay. Thank you. Thank you.